It's time to fire this thing up. Hit it. John, I've got a vision. I was watching your show. I've decided I want to put sea deck in my boat, pretty it up. Okay. With that, I had some ideas, and I want to ask you what you think. I would love to put some of my sponsors in the sea deck in the gunnels. Think about that. When you're inside the boat, Doing so, your fishing so not just on the deck. You're thinking about bringing it up that inner liner, putting it on the gunnels. And, and, and your, your various sponsors that are sponsoring you fishing, like Bob's Machine Shop and- Cost of Sunglasses. Yeah, okay, okay, cool. That, that, that's a really, really great idea. Hey, well, good deal you made it. Hi, I'm John Graviscus. It's awesome to have you back around the boat. Who we have on the program first is Captain Don Mull. You're a professional charter boat captain and you are a fishing tournament guide. Yes, okay, sir. You do a lot of these we tournaments. We do tournaments and fishing, professional fishing guide. Yes, sir. What is this particular craft that we're in right here? How, uh, this is an older one, and, and Old Salts love our older vessels because of how seaworthy they are. What, what is this? This boat is right a garage here? find. This is a 1980, 24 foot, 10 inch Anna Capri. Okay. One of the finest vessels under 30 foot you'll ever ride in. It's so nice, so dry. I, would, I can't wait to take you out in it, show you how comfortable it is to fish. How many tournament fishermen do you think there are in the country? Oh, tens of thousands, probably millions. Okay, so this is gonna be very relevant. This could be a really cool idea for a lot of people in the audience. But guys, what we need to do before we begin is we have to give kudos to all the fabulous companies who help make ShipShake TV possible. ShipShake TV, where boat improvement lives, is made possible by the entire collection of beautiful Sunbrella fabrics. Sunbrella, the only fabric to offer both design and performance above and below deck by Boat Outfitters, your source for replacement hardware, custom king starboard doors, tackle centers, and more. Need it? They'll build it. Visit BoatOutfitters.com to update or customize your boat today by Yamaha. Reliability starts here and by the TaylorMade Group, leading marine manufacturers of original and replacement boat tops and covers, windshields, windows, and hard to find replacement parts. Aftermarket accessories are all new custom T top covers and more. Let us help you make your boat look ship shape again. Welcome back. You're watching Ship Shape TV, boat improvement made easy. So Don, we established you want to do sea deck on the cockpit floor, the gunnel tops, and we're also going to do the under gunnels with your sponsorship logos in there to get them some good exposure too. So sea deck offers a ton of different color options. These are the single color options. So out of these, which, which one kind of catches your eye? They're all really nice, but for for what I need, for what I got going, I believe that this tan, there's darker brown or tan right here is the color I want. Okay, good. Okay. So Sea Deck also has two different textures too. So this is what we call embossed, and then this is called brushed. Which one of those do you like better? That's nice, but this right here is really nice. Yeah. I think I'd like to go with this if that's all right with you. Yeah, 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 for sure. Okay. So they also offer two different, two different colors too that they laminate together. So with the logos, will cut down through the first layer into the second layer, kind of contrast each other. So out of these, you like the mocha, do you like it over black? I think, I think this right here looks the nicest. I mean, they're all beautiful, don't get me wrong, but I think this right here is it's for what pop. I'm, it's gonna pop, it's gonna make that boat look fabulous. I want, I'd like to go with this if you're cool with okay. that. Okay, right. what if I told you there was three colors? Really? Yeah. Show me. So down here, this is called a triple layer. So if you like the mocha over black, we can also do a layer in the middle. Look at that. Do you that. like that? I think, my gosh, that right there for an ocean going boat, right there, that is, that's more than I could even hope for. I really, I think that's great. I like, I like to go with that. Yes, good, sir. Good, good, good. Okay, so we'll cut the logos in that. 
the blue will really pop and contrast really well. And so we also offer fish logos as well. There's a ton of different fish options. We got redfish, snook, tarpon, dolphin, offshore, inshore. For it's this boat, endless. I want to do the offshore if I can. Okay. And what we do a lot of is dolphin fishing. Sure. I get a lot of people come down from up north and they want to go dolphin fishing. It's they're fun to catch, they're good to eat, and they'll keep they'll keep the uh, boat happy all day oh, yeah. long, when man. I mean, up, you just, you gets one after the other. Th it's, it's like a Chinese fire drill out there sometimes. Nice. So, I really like this. So this is this is the the dolphin, and okay. then we also have. I really, I do. I think this pops nice. I think it'll look good with those colors too. Yeah. So we have a hogfish as well, if you like that. I believe, I believe we could probably uh, put a few of those. Oh yeah. In, you know, well, in there, maybe have a, like a little aquarium a look little going aquarium. on. Like what do you that. think about I like that? that? I like that. So we got a triple tail too. Oh, good eating. Cobia, lingfish. We got fish. a cobia. Yep. We can do that as okay. well. And then tuna are really popular this time of year too. Yep. Yep. Well, I, I believe that all of these are really nice. Um, wh whatever works, how it fits in the boat, sure. is fine with me. You can put them any way you want. We'll get a bunch of them in there. All right, let's ha yeah, let's have an aquarium going on. Fish chasing fish. Maybe you got a ballyhoo. They can have one chasing the ballyhoo or like something. It. What do you think about I that? I like it. Let's cool, do man. It. Let's, let's do, do it. it. All, all right. right. Don't sail away. Ship Shape TV will be back in a flash. If you'd like to watch today's episode again, go to our website, ShipShapeTV.com, and watch it free on any device, anytime, anywhere in the world. Tell a boating friend today. We are now at Open Water Concepts, guys, in Stewart, Florida, and welcome back. Just before the break, Captain Don, was selecting various colors that he's going to be putting into not only a sea deck flooring, but also kind of on the inner liner of the boat. And who we now have on the program is one of the owners. This is Jay Beardall. And Jay, you are known as a sea deck certified fabricator, which right. means not only do you do the patterns for the boats, not only install it, but you also cut the sea deck foam, the PVA foam here. Right. Okay. Captain Don actually trailered his boat here, okay, right. to this location, and, and, and boaters can do that in South Florida. But you also have a mobile fleet that kind of goes all over the place, and you can do this same process to anybody, anybody's boat anywhere down here. Right. And I'd like to talk about the process of what Captain Don's doing, because not only does he want the sea deck on his floor, but he also wants it kind of going up inside the boat. And what is this piece of equipment? This is our pro -dim. Pro liner, and we use it to uh, scan the boat. We'll, we'll go out to the boat and get it set up, uh, index points on the boat so the scanner knows, knows where it's at, and then we'll follow the traces of the non skid around the hatches and the floor and the different areas of the boat. So, so this is like literally capturing every piece that's eventually going to be going into his boat, and then does this get transferred into like that CAD program I've heard about? We'll take uh, we'll take the information out of here and transfer it into the into um, our computers into the CAD software in, in order to, to fine tune it and 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 straighten it out and do the radiuses properly. Okay, and now once that's done, all of that data from CAD gets kind of transported over to the CNC machines, and that's where you cut not only Captain Don's C deck, right. but also all the other customers. Now. Open Water Concepts is much more than just Sea Deck, though. You have an entire division where you're working with boat builders and you're professionally cutting kits out of core material, like, like CV boats. Okay, I, I own a CV boat. You will CNC cut the foam for the transoms, for the stringers, for the inner Port liners, tons. okay, all, all that kind of stuff. And who is overseeing that side of the operation? That's my business partner, Rick. Okay, well, I want to learn more about core material. Let's listen up. John, this is the uh, T240 material that's uh, actually in your 32CVZ. That, that's the transit material for my boat. Yes, it is. Okay. Do, do you offer that to boat builders in different thicknesses, Rick? Yes, it is available in different thicknesses. I want to introduce you real quick. This is Rick Estes, one of the owners out here at Open Water Concepts. And um, you work with all the different core materials for yes. boat builders. Okay, Absolutely. that's the other side of the business. What 
is this foam looking material next to the transom material. This is a product from a company called Diab. It's called the Venicel H60. And this product is actually used in the 29 CV deck. There's got to be a ton of different core materials oh, yeah, that absolutely. boat builders demand. W what is this blackish core material with these like threads in it? That's half inch perforated CUSA board. Okay, so it's Blue perforated. Water. These these holes. What are these holes for? Also, again, for infusion. For infusion, and and that's where they're kind of using um, vacuum. Vacuum assist. To, to get the resin into the, resin the part rather than through. hand laying it up? Correct. That, that's got to save on resin cost with the boat manufacturing, and it has to make the part a little bit stronger. It's definitely it? stronger, yes. Okay, super. Um, where would you use in, in boat building this, this white? Uh, that's a PVC board. It's plastic. perforated. It's, uh, you can use it in the inserts on a hard top, or you can use it in upholstery areas. Okay, so the other side of the business is you work with a lot of the boat builders. They're engineers. Correct. And you come up with the exact size for a transom core or a stringer Absolutely. or it's a deck or something like that. You design and fabricate actual kits for composite core material and yes. you deliver it right to the boat builders. Deliver or ship. But you're also a certified seed deck fabricator and we have a lot of viewers in South Florida and they might want that service. They might want seed deck like Captain Don on his boat. How would they get you guys? Where do they go? They go to openwaterconcepts.com and they can call us on the phone number that's listed on the website. Okay. Now, if you're a boat builder and you're trying to take costs out of the manufacturing of a boat out of the equation, you can do it efficiently. You cut the material for them, but you also um, can nest things mm -hmm. because you're really good at, at getting every square inch out of the composite that you can in the sheet. And if a boat builder wanted to save money, is it the same? website is it openwaterconcepts.com yes, absolutely yes it is okay rick this is awesome guys we need to take another break but keep it right here they have a lot of templating they have a lot of cutting they have a lot of sticking to do so that kind of reminds me to say hey guys stick around we'll be back right after the break don't pull the plug the boats the tools and shipshape tv will be back in a snap welcome back aboard Fishing for boat improvement? Well, you caught it right here at ShipShape TV. So in order for Captain Don to do what he does, he needs the support of his sponsors. And it's the same for all the charter captains. They couldn't be out there on the water, you know, making it happen without this kind of support. Now one way for them to show their sponsors is to include the logo in the boat somewhere. Often it's, it's in the wrap on the outside of the boat, and that's all well and good. But you don't see that where the action's happening. When he has a, a customer out on the boat on a charter, it's up on the bow section. That really, everything's taking place. So what we're going to do is we're going to take these under gunnel inner liner pads that we've made for Captain Don. He's chosen a beautiful color combination, a mocha over bimini blue over black. And we're actually going to laser route or burn the, seat at the uh, sponsor's logos right into the pad. Here we have a Fishmasters T-top logo. I think it turned out really well. We're gonna take all of his sponsors, laser them right into the center of those pads, install them in that under gunnel area. Um, you can have logos, boat names included in your boat as well. Just go to cdeck.com, click on custom, find a fabricator and installer near you, tell them what you need, they'll cut the parts, get them to you, you install them, and it's that simple. Guys, where we're at is on probably some of the prettiest waterfront on the eastern seaboard. It's in Jupiter, Florida. This is Blowing Rocks Marina. And if you take a look at all of the really nice boats that are kept in their slips in the water, or we have several on boat lifts here at the marina, uh, guys all over the place will, will have their boats on a boat lift or on their trailer or whatever. And I think that we all really care about what we're putting into the water when we're cleaning our boats. And who we have on the program is Mike Petrucci. And Mike is, the, is, is one of the partners in with BioWave. And guys, I wanna talk to you about a green boat wash that really works. See, traditionally you go to the big box stores, Mike, and you know i think guys care and they get it and they try it and it doesn't do anything it's weak it's limp and and they get turned off and they're going back to strong detergents which really does harm shellfish 
I love clams. I love lobster, okay? It harms the fish. It harms the plant life, the coral reefs, okay? You have now the number one selling marine product online. Correct. This is their boat wash, and we're in the time of the year, guys, spring commissioning. We're all going to be breaking out our boats, taking off the covers, and washing them up to get them out on the water. I really want you guys to try this. And I was hoping, Mike, you could tell everybody a little bit about how this works better than anything. I'm not talking about green. I'm talking about anything. And how it's going to uh, really help save with pollution, with harming pets, harming us possibly with some of these harsh detergents. Exactly. Tell us about BioWave. BioWave, what our whole mission is, 100% biodegradable, uh, non-toxic, and no effect on the environment, children, people, no effects at all. So what we have produced are uh, a, a marine product line that works better than any other product that's on the market. Can, can I ask you a question, Mike? Do, do traditional boat soaps, do, do they kill mold and mildew? They don't uh, kill mold and mildew, and not only does ours kill the mold and mildew, it actually bonds with whatever surface it is, whether it's fiberglass, stainless, or fabric, uh, it will bond with it, put a protective barrier on there, and it'll last for months. This BioWave boat wash won't hurt anything. It's strong as all get out, okay? I'm telling you, it is gonna clean your boat like none other, but it leaves behind a protective kind of barrier from future growth of mold and mildew. Mike, you've had a lot of people from my audience actually write you after they've tried the product. I mean, you, you've been on the show for a while now, okay? Could, could you tell them about what um, some ladies are saying about maybe using some of this stuff in their bathrooms? Yeah, we've, uh, we've had a tremendous response from your viewers, John, where housewives have talked about using this in their showers, even the cloth on your seating outside, et cetera. And then some of the guests have also brought up, I'm using the seat in Bimini. I use it to clean my bathrooms. I use it to clean all of the furniture outside. Um, these and those are, those all are, those are very products. prone areas for mold and mildew on those umbrella fabrics that you have on your lounge chairs and, and stuff like that. And they have three products here, okay? They have the BioWave Boat Wash. Where can people get BioWave Boat Wash? BioWaveMarine.com. Okay, where can people get the BioWave Seat and Bimini Cleaner? Where? BioWaveMarine.com. Hand me that bottle. Guys, this is the BioWave Mold and Mildew Eliminator. After you wash the boat with the boat soap, okay, what you do is you come back and you spritz it with the BioWave Mold and Mildew Eliminator and it bonds to the fiberglass. It bonds to your umbrella seats. It bonds to your Bimini's. It bonds to your vinyl seats, okay? And this is the only product in Marine Guys that is EPA approved to kill mold and mildew. And that's hard to get, okay? This is, is really, really, it is not gonna touch the environment. And Mike, it's springtime, all right? While we're shooting this segment, it's springtime right now. And I know it's gonna be airing for a while, but it's springtime right now. Everybody's opening up their boat. Can we give them an incentive to try something that truly works, that is completely safe for our fragile waters, not hurting anything? Can we give them an incentive to maybe try this for themselves? Because once you try it, guys, you ain't going back. We are happy to do that. And to open up your boat for spring cleaning, we're gonna offer you a 10% discount when you order two or more products. You can combine either one, all three, two. We're gonna offer 10%. What, what the, about shipping? In the promo code, we're gonna be doing ShipShape TV and free shipping. You order one, two, three, a case. It's always free shipping right to your house. One more time, give everybody the website. Guys, please, we all care about the water. Give them the website. BioWaveMarine.com. Ship Ship TV will be right back. Welcome back. You're tuned into Ship Shape TV, America's favorite boat improvement show.
been in all-out installation mode for about the past four hours, guys. Right now, Jeremy from Royal Palm Boats, he's stringing up Captain Don's Fish Master folding T-top. And Don, last time on the program, I installed one. And I can't, but these are so popular, everybody's wanting one. This is amazing. Well, I came by your shop when you were shooting the other show, remember? And I saw that, I said, well, why not? I ordered one and I am in love with this T-top. Jeremy at their repair facility actually all gripped the E-box that comes Correct. with your Fishmaster. Correct. Okay, that's another accessory that you can get for it. But I want you to take a look at the color scheme inside the boat. And, and Don, we need to start at the beginning. Here is how we first saw your boat. Everybody at home, take a look at it, okay? Jeremy's team has moved some stuff around. Everybody at Open Water Concepts has patterned the sea deck accordingly, installing it. We did some laser etching, dude, for your sponsors. And this was his idea. He's like, hey, that's where all the action is. When somebody catches a fish, take a picture. I want my sponsors getting some kudos, you know? Getting some acknowledgement. On the inside of the boat. And, it and makes I, sense. I just think it makes so much sense. But what do you think of our work? Well, I am madly, passionately in love. The, the sea deck is incredible. What they've done with this has transformed my boat, a 1980 center console, to a 2018 brand new boat off do, the show. Do you think boat. other charter guys might uh, catch that idea that you had and say, hey, that's probably not too I, bad? I, I think I'm starting a trend. <laughs> Guys, we have so many people that we need to thank, but most importantly, everybody at home. We're all out of time. I'm John Berbiscus. Again, Captain Don Maul. We'll see you on the next go-around. This thing is beautiful. It is. Guys, look at this. It's amazing. I love the color match. Look how this thing. Look how this came out. See how your blue shade is tying into the blue sea deck? Like that blue wheel, helm wheel to go with it?